You want to know what sucks ass? Loss. Loss is something that stays with you your whole entire life. Even though you think you may be healed, there's going to be something in the future, maybe even today, that's going to make you think like, ah, oh, damn. I miss my mom, dude. <laughs> First thing is why I think loss in media will never ever go away because it's too strong of a like tearjerker, you know? <laughs> Even the most ass movies ever, if they like have their mother die or like a mother of a child die, I'm just like, fuck, dude. Why am I crying? I've been through enough therapy to where I can say I'm actually feeling good about my life. I'm feeling good about everything. Like, I don't really have too much issues to worry about. And like, it's kind of made me more emotional, I realize. <laughs> don't know if that's a good or a bad thing. I'm gonna be real. But yeah, I've been crying a lot more and it's kind of been making me realize that there's a lot of loss in movies. Like growing up, I did see a lot of loss in movies, but like I didn't necessarily make the connection up until my mother died. I was finding Dandy watching Bambi. Oh shit, I'm a rap god. Hold on, hold on, hold on. That was a little too far. I was finding Dandy watching Bambi as a kid, you know. Um, the mother scene didn't really bother me as much. But as soon as my mother died, that just fucked me up. I started looking at that scene. I'm like, nah, bro. Nah, bro, Bambi. I know how you feel. You a real one, Bambi. <laughs> Motherfucker, Bambi too. The mother ain't even there, but they talking about her. I'm like, dude, I'm tearing up like, Am I a pussy? Fox and the Hound, bro. The Fox was being carried away to safety by her mother, a great mother. And holy shit, dude. I never thought about that before. I'm like, dude, why are these mothers dying? Disney and low-key other animation studios were kind of like bullshit and I ain't gonna lie. How the fuck you gonna kill off a mother who isn't even a part of the story and then still make me cry? God. Most of the time, it holds no real like emotional impact or whatever like that, but like, fuck. I just cry, and I cry, and I can't stop crying. Hold on, I look like I'm about to rap, hold on. Boogie's in the back, fuck a cop car. <laughs> I could be wrong, but I think it's because like, we've been through this situation, even if it's like unrealistic as fuck or like something very stupid, we've kind of relate to that situation and like we've been through it. And so it kind of hits hard for us. Or maybe just me, or maybe just me. I might be a bitch. I'll, I'll, I'll admit it, I'll admit it. <laughs> anyway, that's kind of it. I just wanted to rap because you know, I'm crying all the time because I see mothers dying and I'm like, damn. It still hits me. But yeah, that's about it. I forgot to do my intro, so I'm gonna do it at the very last. So how's it going, pups? It's a kid. Cookie in the back like a cop guy. If a dick in my hand, cause I'm a slut.